Your cooking oil could be harming your health in more ways than you know about. Today, I'm going to bring you up to speed on toxic aldehydes and how you can avoid them damaging your health. Now, aldehydes sounds like a chemistry experiment, but they're actually toxic compounds that are formed when certain types of oil are heated for long periods of time and over certain temperatures. And unfortunately, they have been linked to increased inflammation, cellular damage, and increased risk for heart disease and even cancer too. Now, recent research has shown that vegetable oils are the worst offenders when it comes to producing aldehydes hides when they're heated. But don't worry, there are better alternatives to look. Now the same research showed that coconut oil and butter were by far better. And it was actually coconut oil that was leading the way in terms of the least aldehydes that were produced. But what was clear from the research is that the longer time taken to cook at higher temperatures means that the more aldehydes are produced, regardless of what cooking oil you're gonna use. So my advice is if you're gonna cook at high temperatures to use coconut oil, and to limit that cooking time to 10 minutes or less if you want to reduce your production of these toxic aldehydes in your food.